Hi Leo, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading and the questions I will be answering are What happened in the past? How do they feel about you now? What are their intentions for you now? And the potential outcome for August 2020. If you want to support me, you can buy me a coffee in the link in the description. Thanks a lot. I highly appreciate your support. Now let's get started. Let's do three shuffles for the sign of Leo, please, for the month of August 2020 and for the questions I just said. So let's do three shuffles. First shuffle. Second shuffle. And the last one. Now please, what happened in the past between Leo and their ex? What happened in the past? Three of Wands. Knight of Cups. And the full card. The overall energy, let's see for the reading in the past for the connection is Seven of Swords. Okay. So it seems to me like uh, the cause of the breakup was they cheating on you. With the Seven of Swords here, there's some sneaky behavior. Maybe there was a third party situation, also three of ones here. But someone cheated, and that's what ended the relationship. One of the partners was Romeo and uh, Juliet. It was, uh, it was also an immature thing that started without thinking, without giving much thought. And it had progress with the three of ones. There was some progress in the relationship. But uh, I feel it was not... Uh, was not a stable relationship. Yes, it has... It has... Uh, it had a lot of passion and uh, emotions there and everything started without giving too much thought to the connection. But someone cheated. And that's what uh, brought the break up. Now let's see the other question. How do they feel about you now? How does this cheater feel about Leo now? Please. How does they feel about you now? Magician. Let's see two other cards. Eight of Cups. King of Swords. Why the Magician, please? Four of Wands. Why the King of Swords, please? Eight of Swords, and why the Eight of Cups? Ten of Swords. What they are thinking now is that uh, the connection had the great potential to grow to a commitment, serious commitment, maybe a marriage. But uh, them cheating on you and uh, you leaving because there was a lot of pain. So they are aware that they cheating on you caused you a lot of pain and uh, you were you had no other choice but uh, to leave the connection. And uh, you may have been dealt with an air sign Libra, Gemini or Aquarius, 
and uh, they know you had to make to make a cold decision and that thing was not uh, and what's the decision you didn't want to make so they are aware that you made a decision a cold decision because of uh, your of uh, the ex cheatings and uh, they are aware you didn't want to do that but you left because that caused a, a lot of pain and they are aware also that the connection had a lot of potential to to grow to something stable let's see what are their intentions for you now? Page of Source. They are stalking at you in social media. They are walking. Uh, they are asking others maybe for you. What are you doing? What you are up to? Ten of Wands. They feel like. The connection was all a burden. And the Knight of Pentacles. Why the Ten of Wands, please? Two cards wanted to come out. Knight of Wands and Knight of Swords. So they are thinking about you a lot now. They are stalking on social media, maybe asking a lot of uh, people about you, what you are up to, what is your current relationship status, maybe. And uh, their intention is the Knight of Pentacles. They want to offer you a stable relationship and uh, to take things more... Uh, um, not in a fast pace, uh, to take there in a slow movement to give time the relationship to grow. Why the Knight of Pentacles, please? Yes, the Empress. They want to offer you love, they want to grow and expand with you. They feel like what they did was not good, right? And uh, that has left them sleepless and, and night, at night and they are anxious and are thinking a lot to to message you come towards you why the page of source please yes they are not talking talking to you they are only stalking they are closed off for the moment but they want to message and uh, talk uh, or they are waiting for you to message because it seems like uh, what they did was a, a, a big fault from their side and they know the mistake they may have done and uh, the opportunity they missed. Let's see what is the potential outcome for August 2020 for the past relationship you had with your ex. What is the potential outcome for the month of August 2020, please? Three of Swords. The World Card. Five of Pentacles. And the bottom card is the Four of Swords. So the potential outcome for the connection uh, for the month of August 2020, it seems like um, there will be no communication. It will be the end of the relationship. And... Uh, Maybe they say if they cheated once, they may cheat twice or third. So if uh, this connection was given another chance, it would lead to heartbreak again and to being uh, left out in the cold, abandoned. And maybe the message 
here the cards are trying to to say is that it's time to finish the cycle with the past person because uh, uh, the pain is not worth it or they may repeat their fault they did in the previous uh, they did previously so it's not recommended to to give it another chance it's a no no better to end the cycle or the the cycle karmic cycle will end in august 2020 between you and uh, your ex so that was what i had for you leo i hope uh, this reading helped please let me know in the comments if this story resonated with you and please like and subscribe uh, it helps to grow uh, the channel it's it is a new channel and also motivates me to post more regularly and uh, at the same time if it did not resonate because it may or may not resonate it is a general uh, reading uh, after all and uh, you can check your moon rising and venus signs they are in the playlist you can check the other signs there and see and get a better idea of your current energies if uh, this story did not resonate with you anyway uh, thanks for listening and uh, until the next video i wish you good luck and uh, bye for now